Have you started your LLC and now you're thinking, wait, how do I pay myself? You're not alone. Understanding how and how much to pay yourself from your LLC can be daunting. Hi, I'm Alina from Collective, the formation, tax, and accounting solution for self-employed people. Keep watching because we're talking about all things paying yourself. And don't worry, it's not as complicated as it sounds. First, how much should you pay yourself? To determine that, it's crucial to understand your net income. Net income is what's left after you subtract your expenses from your income. You can find your net income at the bottom of your profit and loss statement. Once you know your net income, consider how you want to use this money. You know that you want to pay yourself, but how much will be influenced by business debts, investments you want to make for the business, and savings goals. Also, don't forget that you need to put away money for taxes. The key to determining how much to pay yourself is to strike a balance between your business needs and your personal needs. Now, onto the exciting part, actually paying yourself. There's no rule for how often you need to pay yourself. You can choose to pay yourself twice a month, every week, or once a month. The frequency is completely up to you. Now, how you pay yourself is just as simple. You can write yourself a physical check, or set up a transfer from your business account to your personal account. So what about being on payroll and paying yourself through a paycheck? Before we talk about how to do this, it's important to understand the difference between an owner draw and a salary. An owner's draw involves taking money out of the business for personal use. A salary means you'll receive money through payroll. You'll pay payroll taxes on those earnings and receive a W-2 at the end of the year. Your business tax classification will determine if you can pay yourself through payroll. Sole proprietors, single member LLCs, not filing with S Corp election, and partnerships can only pay themselves through owner's draw. The IRS considers these types of entities pass-through entities, and the owners can't be paid through payroll. In this scenario, you won't pay taxes on the amount you draw out. Instead, you'll pay taxes on your total taxable net profits through your individual tax return. Keep in mind that regardless of whether you keep your money in your business or draw it out, you'll be taxed on the total profits. S-Corp owners are typically required to pay themselves a reasonable compensation via payroll. The money earned goes into the business and you're an employee of that business. That means you'll need to set up payroll and make regular salary payments to yourself. If you wanna pay yourself even more throughout the year, you can either increase your salary or take a distribution, which is just another way of saying an owner's draw. We have a video linked in the description on S-Corp owner salary requirements. And that's your quick primer on how to pay yourself through your LLC. And if you need more help with your self-employed business, go to collective.com and learn how we can help you with your business, formation, taxes, accounting, and bookkeeping. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.